I want to win. I want that trophy. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'm going to be ranking my favorite Charlie XCX album, and that is number one, Angel. Yesterday, uh, I did pop two ranking, so I'm gonna do this one, and then I'll do one more of her albums on this channel, and then her other three will be on my other channel. My shirt is the shirt that my uh, friend's mom gave me. Billy's mom gave this to me, so yeah. Anyways, we're gonna start this video now with number 10, and number 10 is Baby Girl. I'll be your baby girl. I don't really like this song. I think it's annoying. I never really listened to it. I've heard it like twice and I just I just don't like it. Number nine, roll with me. Find out. Do you wanna roll with me? Do you wanna roll with me? Say yeah. This one's better than Baby Girl, but I still don't like it. And that's all I'm gonna say, so yeah. Number eight is Dreamer. This song I actually like. It's just not as good as the other ones. But I do like Dreamer. Charlie sounds good when she's mumble rapping. Like, mumble rappers are annoying, but she sounds good when she does it. And she has, like, a couple other girls on here who I have no idea who they are, but their verse is slay. Number seven, Emotional. We had something that never happened. Uh, this song is sort of relatable, but it's not, like, the most relatable. And it's kind of depressing, and I usually like depressing music, but because it's not relatable, and there's a lot of other songs on this album that are better, I'm putting it at number seven. Number six is Lip Gloss featuring Cupcake. Pussy tastes sweet cause I ate my pineapples, light a couple candles, too, you can handle a pussy gooey like yo before the eggs crumble. Cupcake always has like good songs with Charlie, I don't know like why, but like her songs with her always slay. Uh, this song is very dirty though, and not for kids, it's too sexual, so don't play this around anyone who's like under like 15 or something, because it is bad. Number 5 is White Roses. Taking off our clothes, giving you it all, all I need is you and me alone. For some reason she sounds like Britney Spears in this song, and I don't know why. Not like vocally wise, but the way that she sings, she's like trying to sound like Britney. Like the same style I mean, but it's like really good. I like the beat, I like the lyrics, and it's just overall a really good song. Number four is drugs. When you call me, feels like diamonds raining down on me. This song isn't relatable to me because I don't like drugs and I don't respect people who do drugs and that's kind of contradicting because Charlie obviously does it. But the song sounds really good. And uh, I love the part where she's like, love, 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 love of my life part uh, at the end. Well, she goes, love, 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 drugs that I like. That's my favorite part of the song. Number three is Blame It On You. Take drugs with a waste me race and love it when you drive. Bad boy, make a bad girl, now that's got my hands so high. This song is relatable. Um, it's really catchy and it's talking about like a toxic relationship that she can't help to like be in. She's blaming it on the guy when it's mostly her fault, but like, I mean, relatable, right? Number two is I Love You Too. You know, I never really thought about how it feels to say this was a love. Coincidence that the one with two in it is number two. This sounds like really like sweet and cute, and it has a nice beat. It's all bubbly, and like, I just relate to like the last verse and it's like really good number one the big number one is 3 a.m. pull up I relate to this song so much cuz of Billy if you just listen to the words you'll be like wow you'll feel my pain that's another Charlie song that we'll be ranking in another video anyways so that is my number one and I recommend you go listen to it. Listen to this whole album. This is her best one to me. This is like my favorite Charlie album. And it isn't even classified as an album. It's classified as a mixtape, which is weird to me, but yeah. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching this video. Uh, comment down below your ranking. I really need to go eat, so I'm gonna go do that. Like, comment, subscribe, and do all that, and bye. Wondering, would you be my little quarantine?